Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, is proud to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Daybreak Classic is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this third round action. Luke Elby alongside Rich Beam. And Rich, this player's been playing some impressive golf. They've got the lead. They're where they want to be. But what should be their mindset going into this round? Well, hopefully it's not on the chasing pack because the chasing pack is filled with some big names. So they're going to have to really bear down, focus on the task at hand. They've got to sit there and keep their emotions to themselves and not get wrapped up in everybody that's around them. It's all set up to be a beauty. Let's see how it unfolds. Let's see what kind of Tony sets for himself today. That's a good looking shot there. Lining up from around 160 yards. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. They've decided to club up. And he's safely on the green. An opportunity for a birdie here. Looking really good. And it'll be a good result. I know it didn't go down, but it just a tap in awaits. And that fine play ensures they hold top spot on the leaderboard with John Rahm trailing in second place. Ooh, I always love these holes. Here we have a par three. Looks to be going with the five iron. That's not the outcome they were after. Let's see if we can get this one up and down for par. It's just about three feet away. And well hold. Let's move on. And staying right where they were in today's rankings after that. Here we are at the third. Luke, if you're a fan of Pebble Beach Golf Links, you're absolutely going to love this hole. Just 444 yards from the back tees. Driver really isn't necessary as there is out of bounds over on the right-hand side that comes into play in a hurry. Just avoid the bunkers on the left-hand side. Find the fairway. Second shot plays slightly uphill. It actually looks like an infinite edge pool. It's really difficult to judge distance control with that second shot. Still a great hole, one that you dearly love to make birdie on. Getting ready to play their third. Ooh, right by the hole. Pretty good chance here. This one's for par. In she goes. Let's head to the next. He's currently sitting in first place. Love the long holes. Welcome to the par five. Well, on the tee now, coming off a par. Chance to pipe one up the middle. Oh, well done. Time for the second shot here at the fourth. 
Going with a three wood here. And here we are with the third shot. Didn't that look good for a long time? Lovely touch. Well played. Oh, Dr. Chapinski strikes again. Leading by a potentially insurmountable 11 strokes after that one. Not sure why I said potentially. Here we are at the fifth hole. to have opted for the eight iron this one might need to get down a little yeah well played still a fair way away from the hole here time to make a long putt this for back-to-back -back birdies Didn't quite have the right stuff there. A good opportunity here, just six feet to the hole. For the par. Well, the leader is really starting to gap the field now. They're 10 strokes ahead. Time to take a look at what this par four might be in order. Well, Rich, in the thick stuff here, not a good spot to be. Opting for the five iron. Yep, solid connection. This is looking good. OK, not the best result, but a chance to get up and down. Blame the caddy. Ooh, that almost went down. That's a wonderfully played chip shot there. Love watching this player around the greens. Putting for par. That's a good punt to make, that one. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Deep into the front nine. Here we are at the seventh hole. Oh, this one looks to be heading down the runway. What a year with five victories already this season. Oh, I like the courage here, Rich, getting after this par five and two. As they should. What a play. Hopefully they'll be rewarded for that play. And he's down there. You got a read? Yeah, they've left it in the perfect spot here, just below the hole. They can be aggressive up the hill. Oh, so close. Yeah, that looked to be a bit of a misread. Three feet to go here to the hole. Little birdie look in here. And after that hole, they currently lead in first place with John Rahm in second. 
Ooh, we're at the par three here. I love these holes. Well, well played. Oh, these are big momentum putts. Let's make this one from nine feet. All right, guys, this for two birdies in a row. Oh, that was such a good stroke. A wonderful putt. You can claim it. Back to back birdies. Two in a row there, Luke, getting their groove on. This player must be in heaven. Their lead is now 11. Here we go. We're beginning the ninth hole now. For those who like to work the golf ball from left to right, you're going to have to take a little bit of a chance by aiming over that hazard on the left-hand side. But if you find the fairway, boy, I tell you what, that's a fantastic feeling because this hole has got so much beauty. I love the second shot, the bunkers on the front, but I love how the green runs away on the left-hand side. The design of this hole, especially the green, is absolutely amazing. Well, that's a handy shot. And he's down there. Setting up here from about 190 yards. Looks to be going with a hybrid here. Oh, this one should find the surface. Good shot, this. Yeah, that was a safe play. Let's see if we can make this big putt for birdie. Okay, steady now. No, oh, that's too bad. He's got a par putt here. Let's see if he can make it. And there it is. Rich, how are we looking after nine? Well, it's been great watching this player get the best of their rival, but still a long way to go until the end of this tournament. Let's see how it shakes out. Awesome stuff. playing to an elevated green here. Let's see if they've got the right club. Going with the nine iron, I think. Nicely done. What are we looking at for this putt, Henny? He's looking at 20 foot. This will be a good putt to hold. Just didn't drop. Putting for a par here. Down she goes. Let's head to the next. Still in the lead now after that hole. Teeing off now at the 11th hole.
Oh, that's a high caliber shot. That's not what they were looking for. Coming up a little short with that effort. Not bad, though. Oh, that one just missed the hole. Okay, so that finishes that hole. And that fine play ensures they hold top spot on the leaderboard with John Rahm trailing in second place. We have a par three on this one. And choosing the eight iron here. Didn't quite strike that as cleanly as they would have hoped. And coming up well short. And a par putt awaits him. Nice little putt to hold that one. He sits in first position. It's time to begin this powerful hole. Lovely effort, that. Penny, what have they got in front of them here? Setting up here from about 165 yards. Oh, that one's straight at the pipe. Taking things up a notch in this Lexi Thompson rivalry, that shot will add some fuel to the fire. A good stroke. Nice one. Fourth birdie of the day. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after that hole. Now on the tee after a birdie, fired up and ready for more. Good shot there, Beamer. And what's in front of them there, Henny? He's got, mm, I'd say, a solid 145 here. Going with the eight iron here. Oh, that's a great approach shot. And as good as they putt, you almost have to guarantee this one. This putt is of nine feet. This is what they have left for birdie here. Nice stroke. Geez, making this look easy. Keeps surging ahead. Kind of like it. Two in a row. He's feeling it. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Lovely momentum for this player after that birdie at the last hole. Keep it rolling.
This one's going right at the pin here. Magical shot. Almost a gimme birdie there, Luke. Fantastic. Mark it down. That's six birdies today. And now that finds him in first place. Next up is this par four hole. Wonder how they will play this hole. Do they want to attack it? If so, they can extend their lead. What a gargantuan tee shot. Time for the second shot at the 16th. Not a bad play, that one. And this putt is for birdie three on the scorecard. Was that a good line? Well, yeah, it's a bit disappointing. Just three feet to go to the hole. Don't miss this. They can be costly. And this is quality play. Still on top of the leaderboard. The par five awaits here, but so does an opportunity. Take full advantage. Every player is going to be salivating to get here. This could be the easiest hole by a long shot on this golf course. The fairway, massive, most generous fairway out here. Second shot, a little bit uphill, but let's face it, just 506 yards, slightly uphill. I promise you, every player in this field is thinking eagle and nothing but. Second shot here on the 17th. Getting ready to play their third. Yeah, you like the look of that right off the blade. That was sensational, Luke. And let's have another look at that one. He's currently sitting in first place. And now teeing off on the final hole of this round. Well, Rich, I'm pretty sure this player will be beaming with pride after that eagle. Let's see if they can keep the momentum flowing. Playing from around 160 yards. Looks to have opted for the eight iron. Quality shot, that one. What's in front of them, Henny? Has to put this one downhill. Hey, nice looking line. That signs off on this player's performance for the day.